Time now for Sports News. Nairobi City Stars head coach Sanjin Alajik has encouraged those seeking to pursue coaching to ensure they have attained proper certification in order to avoid future conflicts with relevant football authorities. This coming less than two weeks after Africa's football governing body CAF said that recently appointed Gold Mahia head coach Roberto Oliveira Goncava Goncav Calves does not qualify to coach in CAF championships. Nairobi City Stars head coach Sanji Nelajic has urged coaches to invest in their education if they are to embark on coaching in most leagues in the world. I really think education is so important for the coaches. One side it's experience, it's your knowledge, it's your self-education, well, how much you invest in yourself like the coach. But in other side is also you must go for that license, you must go to, to learn some new stuff and that what you learn you can transfer to your players. Back in 2018, I was in Kisumu for the FKF AGM and one of the motions in that AGM was that for every foreign coach coming to Kenya, the federation has to do a due diligence. So for every foreign coach you pay 100,000 and the federation now does a background checking for you. So they check with CAF and then they check with the, the country where the coach comes from and then they check with FIFA if the coach is registered. City stars who earned promotion to the top flight after staying out in the calls for four years will take on KCB tomorrow and Alajek is confident his charges can replicate the performance exhibited in their win against Zoya Sugar in their first match of the season. We watch KCB, I watch their game against Posta and we play even friendly match with them. I know their quality, that's a good team. Uh, but also the team who have some good quality strength in front, but also they have some weakness and we will speak today about that weakness and we will try to use that weakness against them. If you look at KCB, their players and where they were last season, clearly they are the favourites to win this game. We are the clear underdogs. Of course we are looking for positive results. I wouldn't say we will win or whatever will be the results, but we will approach it very carefully. And of course, we'll be looking for the points. Kurir, on the other hand, has emphasized on the need to create a stable playing unit if the team is to maintain its status in the top flight next season. If you look at the history of Kenyan clubs, you get promoted, end of the season, you go back down to where you came from. I think in our signings, we tricked our squad in such a way that that scenario does not happen to us. So we want to maintain our status and we want to become a strong team in the league. That is our... See, when you come from the second league, you need to stay humble. I, I always say that we make the strategy even from last year first to make good stable club and after that we will go step by step. The same situation is now. We come in the top flight and I want in the period when I'm here to make good stable club in the Premier League. City Stars beat Nzoya Sugar 2-0 last weekend while KCB were 3-0 winners away to post the Rangers.